When will I be free of this agonizing limbo Imogen? <laughs> Very soon, Mighty Jack. The moment I hand the Coral Sword over to the Wizard of Magic Mountain, he's promised to give me the elixir of the eternal camp. Silence, ruthless one! <laughs> and why are you wasting time, huh? <laughs> Hurry, Imogen. Bestow yourself. Get me the elixir of the eternal candle, that I may rule the world as foreordained. Yes, sir. Fatuous asses. That stupid, scruffy, bedraggled bird scared the pants off me. Hey, Amy, Dweezy, the water's great. Come on in, you guys. We're fine just where we are. Thanks all the same. <laughs> hey, that felt great. I haven't been in the water for ages. Huh? Hey, you guys, where's my coral sword? I left it right here. Oh, no! My rucksack's gone, too! What is this? Yum. Ooh. Hmm. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> there, now it's nice and clean. Ah, <laughs> oh, I see Ooh. you found my sword. I've been looking all over for it. <laughs> I'm certainly grateful that you cleaned it for me. I'll just take it back now. Thank you. Oh, you are mistaken, miss. This sword belongs to the young turtle who's taking a dip in the stream over yonder. Huh? Well, it doesn't matter. Give it to me anyway. <clears throat> no! <gasps> Stop! Stop, you thief! Come back Ooh. here! Thief! <laughs> Come back here, you thieves! It's those three miscreants again! You mustn't let them out of your sight! How do I manage that? No problem! Hop on my back, hero! <laughs> well, what do you know? We weren't even looking to catch them, and the sword fell right into our hands! <laughs> Look out! Boy. It's you. It's both of us, me and my sword. <laughs> Are you guys all right? Oh no, my super double turbo. You mean this pile of junk over here? Huh? What do you mean pile of junk? That's a state of the art masterpiece. But never mind that. The car race is tomorrow and what are we gonna do now? Car race, you see? What the heck is that? It's an annual event we hold to establish the best car racer in the forest. It's called the Badger Cup Invitational. I guess you guys aren't here to take part in it, since you don't know what it is. So we must be near Badger Town. The Badger Cup Invitational, huh? Sounds like fun. I promised my dad I'd win first prize this year. I've just got to do it. You know I don't want you getting hurt, Woody! Mommy! The rucksack and the sword needed a good cleaning, and that's something we badgers are fanatical about and good at. Doesn't it look good now? Good? It looks brand spanking new! It never occurred to me that you might think it was stolen. I'm sorry about that. Oh, that's no problem, really. The point is I got it back. And where's that cat and her two bandit brothers? Well, sis, what do we do now? Got any ideas? Not at the moment. Drop that badger kid in his car. Look! Something's coming our way! I don't like the sound of that. Let's get out of here. Ugh. 
Ah, oh, too bad. The car Woody's been working on so hard all year got pretty banged up, didn't it? <laughs> well, I think we ought to help it along on its way to the junkyard. <laughs> Come on, boys. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just what do you think you're up to, baby? I'm just finishing off what you started. <laughs> hey, please. We'll have no violence here. Huh? Yeah! Bullies. You obviously don't know who you're dealing with, Runt. I don't even care. Well, we're the sons of the village leader, chum. So you watch your step. Let's go. <laughs> the village leader, big deal. Anyway, we just guaranteed that we'll win the cup again this year. We'll take care of you later, turtle. <laughs> What was that all about? Those are not nice kids. They're sheer evil. Anyway, we've got to fix the car. Let's get to work. I think I'll pass on that, Woody. <laughs> yeah, I really don't want to antagonize Biggie and his brothers. Yeah. They're so scary. Oh, no. Oh, Woody. Gosh. Woody fell down and go boom. Oh, kid. <clears throat> They may be the sons of the village leader, but they run lawless and have no manners whatsoever. It'd be terrific if Woody could beat those three little criminals in the Invitational this year. But they've won two years running now. Biggie's dad is so rich, he buys him everything he asks for. A custom-made chassis, all the spare parts. It's not fair. Anyway, there's no sense going on about it. I couldn't enter the race at all right now. The rules are clear. There has to be a team of three driving the car. Well, would you be able to race if we helped out, Woody? <coughs> what? Do you mean that? Would you really be part of my racing team? Yeah. That's great. But what do we do about the car? It's a wreck. Leave it to me, Woody. you're simply long for. Yeah, I'd sure love to have it. I don't mind admitting it. I feel the same way. A great, big, shiny, wonderful prize. Something that everyone longs for. All things considered, I think I'll join the team. Wow! With the two of you, we have the three required for the team, and we can enter the race! Good for you, son. Include me out! Why? You guys lose sight of our objective too easily. You're such feather brains. You get so distracted. I want to get to Miracle Mountain so the wizard can teach me to fly. I'll be seeing you. Don't take any wooden euros. And the best of British luck to you. He stuck steering bonkers. Up, 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 up. The fat head. Imagine giving up a chance to win a beautiful, shiny prize. All right, we'd better get busy. We have a lot to do to get her all ship-shape and Bristol fashion by race time. I'll call the Super Turbo Woody Hero 3. That scene presents certain features of interest, sis. Look over there. Where? There! <sighs> Give me those bolts. Thank you. 
It looks like they plan on entering the race along with that kid we saw this morning. Should we do a sneak gorilla attack on them during the night? Don't be so all-fired hasty. If they're entering the race, the only really intelligent thing for us to do is to enter it also. We wait until they're on some lonely stretch in the forest and then we pounce. Yes, you not only got a D-cop, you got brains. Well, if you don't mind my saying so, there's a glitch. We don't have us no car. <clears throat> so get busy right away. <gasps> hmm. I have in mind an interesting variation on the plan. <laughs> All contestants for the Badger Cup Invitational to the starting line. You're gonna win this time and just know it. I know it. Just keep it going. Yeah. All systems are go. We'll give them a run for their money, all right? Never mind run for their money. We're gonna win. I like your attitude, little lady. You've got Marcy. Let's go. That's right. There's nothing wrong with having high expectations, kids, even though it'll all turn out to be just a pipe dream in the end. What? <laughs> all right, so you really want to know what it feels like to be a winner this year? Well, come to me after the race, and I'll describe it to you while they're giving you the third place consolation prize. <laughs> what? Oh, does he get me angry? Hero, we just can't let those three loathsome toadstools win. Definitely not. One for the Keeper! We shall all make a concerted effort to hasten their defeat. We'll do everything we can to help you win, Woody! Hey, let's get this show You good guys! I'm gonna win this race! You just watch me, Mom and Dad! And here comes the starting gun now, everyone! Time to shift out of low gear. I've got to catch up. Huh? huh? So long, suckers. <laughs> when did the horrible three enter the race? They just better not get in our way. Fire one. <laughs> <laughs> you don't. Can't you do anything right? How many rocks are there left? <gasps> hey, get away! Get a taste of this! just started making from scratch last night, sis. All indications favor the swift ah. implementation of plan B. Why do those two get themselves sidetracked so easily? I can't help but wonder where they are. Probably getting themselves into trouble as usual. Mm -hmm. No, Luigi, do not waste time thinking about Amy and Hero. No, Duigi, they are simply hindrances to the noble purpose of your journey. Oh? Oh. Which way do we go, Woody? There's a shortcut to the left, but it has a steep slope that's quite dangerous. If we go to the right, it'll take a little longer, but it's safer. In that case, we go to the left. Of course. Well, remember the old saying? The roundabout way is the better way. So I say let's go to the right. Why take the roundabout way? They say if you're rushed, you'll make mistakes. So the roundabout way turns out to be the faster way anyhow. 
How can the slower way be the faster way? That's ridiculous. Let's go to the left. No, to the right. To the left. Let's huh? just get going already. Step on it. Well, Tyson, are you ready to go? Sure thing, sis. Just give me the word. Not yet. Now. <gasps> That's Maggie and his brothers. I told you, I knew it was better to take the safer road. Mm-hmm. Oh, my God. <gasps> this is dangerous. <laughs> You're finally getting your comeuppance, hero. As of today, the world is mine! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> we really surfed him up this time. <laughs> Looking good. Mission accomplished, I would say. Let's admire our handiwork. <laughs> How dare you throw a net over us? Are you crazy? I could kill you for that. I'm terribly sorry, really. You ain't gonna let him go scot free, are you? Uh, please calm your wrath. We made a mistake. We're sorry. <laughs> you stupid boneheaded jerks! You cost us precious time in the middle of the most important race of the year—a race which we now run the risk of losing. <laughs> what, what, what are you gonna do to us? This. I'm this. Oh. Go. Let's go. We've wasted too much time. Don't these things ever happen to anyone else? <laughs> The Super Turbo Woody Hero 3 is destroyed! Ah! Oh. <laughs> Hero! <laughs> it's the end for you now, Hero. So just hand over that sword like a good boy. Then I'll send you down to the bottom of the cliff and collect the sword later. Yeah! Hero! Huh? Luigi! You guys are just helpless without me. Admit it! We owe you big time on this one, that's for sure. Let's get going, guys. I'd love to. But we have no means of propulsion, Amy. Oh, yeah, what am I? Chop liver? Mm -hmm. Huh? Uh. This is really gonna be exciting! Hey, and it looks yeah. like we're gonna yeah. win again this year, kids! <laughs> Lost again this year. Chalk up another one. Yes, indeed. Oh, no, not again. There is Woody's car on the other road. Way to go, Woody. <laughs> Mom, Dad, I've won! We're oh, so proud! As they say, it's better to be safe than sorry. Is that what they say? <laughs> it's all your fault! Quit <laughs> that, mate! I don't oh, oh, brothers oh. like you! <laughs> And here's the prize for this year's winner of the Invitational. I owe it all to my great crew and... Thanks. Uh, uh. 
I just can't wait to see what this great, big, wonderful, shiny prize is. Huh? What the heck is this? Huh? It's a washboard. That's a symbol of how everything can become shiny and clean if you work hard. It's an icon of profound sociological significance for us badges. Is that what you guys work so hard for? I can't believe it. Yep, things are sure going to be shiny and clean from now on. <laughs> What's so darned funny? If you don't mind, would you let those three creatures over there borrow it, would you? It's the terrible trio. Yeah, they have to do the village's <laughs> laundry for interfering in the race. Then of course they may borrow it. It's a pleasure for us. woman. <laughs> <laughs> Hero Amy and Dweegee have brought clean and refreshing laughter to Badger Town. Although they still have a long way to go, they're finding out that it's a good thing to make friends and build up a store of memories along the way. As the old saw has it, the roundabout way is the better way. <laughs>